Jay Cole here, and today we're going to be working on a quick tutorial for Mary Had a Little Lamb. And no, not the nursery rhyme version, but the buddy guy turned Stevie Ray Vaughan version from the 1980s album Texas Flood. And unlike that version, which is tuned to E flat, we'll be keeping it in standard tuning just to keep things simple. And uh, we'll be breaking it down bit by bit. It's really just a three chord blues song, but because of the funkiness of it and the timing of it, it can be a little bit tricky. There's a look at the end that I'll focus a little bit more on. And then again, today is just going to be the rhythm. We'll focus on the, uh, the lead uh, with the next video. Uh, and with that, let's get into the song. Uh, if you like this video, be sure to like and subscribe. And uh, hopefully we'll see you soon. start from the beginning. So unlike Stevie Ray, we're going to be doing it in standard tuning like we talked about before. Uh, so that is the only difference, but all of the note choices and everything else are the same. So we're going to start by going open on the A string, open on the D string, G, and then to an E7 with a high D on the B string. through the pentatonic blues scale. We're going to go bending up from the third fret, so up from a G to a, an A. Open. Open. Faster though, I like to do it with my, my middle and my pointer finger. I think it's a little smoother. Just the first part, the main riff of it, and we'll come back to the solo uh, next time. 